Michael J. Fox once said, what makes things in life so special is not necessarily what we have to lose, but what we have to gain. Today, I'm gonna to speak to you regarding the ways that animals are a lot of times better than people are. Whenever I say animals, I'm referring specifically to those that are in our homes, like our pets. This little guy that you see here is Petri Dish. Petey came to me about five years ago and he wound up in um, my mom's garage on a really horrible stormy night with bad hail and storms. And the next morning they walked into the garage to find him and he was batting at their feet and trying to play. And I um, had recently had to have a hysterectomy due to medical problems. And I decided that Petri dish was just God's way of giving me a baby. Um, after some time with Petey, we've gotten very close. We've been on many adventures all over the place. Um, if he looks a little bit um, unhappy, it's because he's not crazy about being on screen, but also he recently um, was attacked by another dog and it was a whole ordeal. But he's what inspired me to actually speak to you today about why animals are so important, um, specifically those pets that we have in our homes. I know that on a daily basis, regardless of the stresses of my life, whether I'm sad or, or concerned or worried about money or bills or even now holiday gifts, I know that this little guy is gonna be super excited to see me every time I walk through the door. Mr. Joel Duncan actually explains um, in his article that a lot of times animals are better than people as friends, um, but also because they can save our lives. Most of us know that animals are used by the police department in order to solve crimes, um, to find people that are missing um, and are able to tra tra track us down and um, trace us and figure out where we are and what's happening. A lot of times they can even warn us when we've got issues in our own lives. Um, anything regarding um, like even cancer, dogs can smell cancer. My son has a cat that he absolutely adores who loves to cuddle and play with him. Um, but Mr. Joel Duncan also goes on to explain that emotional support animals are a really big deal. He explains that there are um, registered emotional support animals all the way from birds to even alligators. And while Petey's not much of an alligator here, um, I know that he loves me and he does try to defend me. Say for instance, at the grocery store, anybody who's getting out of their car definitely uh, will have to watch out for this little guy's barks. Um, so with this, my informing you of my situation and my story with my animals, but also um, some of the information that Mr. Joel Duncan um, has written about, know that um, every day life can be very special, especially because of the animals that might be in our lives and in our homes. Um, if you need a friend, a lot of times a pet is a good place to look to because they're gonna love you regardless, no matter what. They're thankful for everything that we do, um, whether that's just feeding them or taking them for a walk or sometimes just walking through the door. If you can actually hear um, some of the whimpers in the background, that's another chihuahua of mine. Her name is Ruth Bader Ginsburg. Um, and speaking of emotional support animals, while I'm very much her emotional support human and this little guys, they're also my emotional support um, animals. They haven't started going to work with me yet, but eventually they will. From my first quote from Michael J. Fox stating that thing, what makes things in life more special isn't necessarily what you have to lose, but what you have to gain goes back and ties into the fact that sometimes it's the animals that randomly show up in our lives, whether it's a stray or somebody is giving away an animal. Um, a lot of times that can completely and entirely change our lives and they're absolutely worth it and always necessary. So if you need a pal, I would definitely look to maybe getting a pet um, or maybe in the future. And if you know anybody else who needs a pet, um, I think it's a good idea. We know that a lot of times our, even our friends or our family, they get stressed out or concerned or worried about things in life too. But animals are always here for us. Thank you.